Oh, looks like we're inside the base now. So now we don't need to worry about losing our air and just being out and open and exposed. That looks like a boss. I don't want to open that. I think instead, I will go over here and do everything I can before opening that. <laughs> That's the general idea. Don't... Don't dig too greedily and too deep or else you'll have dangerous... Destructomatic devices. And, uh, you don't want that. The so Balrogs are dangerous creatures of habit. And, yeah, I can't actually destroy that. Just had to... Is there a chopper in here? Sort of sounds like one, but... Hmm. I have a feeling we're gonna have to, like, make the giant mech try to hit these things. And then from there, um... We win? Possibly? I don't know. And then two out of two, so... Yeah, it's two out of four of the police badges. I don't know where, where else, like... I think the rest of the police badges might actually just be these, uh... Rex Fury pulley devices. Which is always an unfortunate thing, but... You know how it goes sometimes. But, do I... Oh, that doesn't hurt me. I thought that, like, it looks like it's very electrified and uh, dangerous. Armed and dangerous. But I have colors. I don't know where I'm, I will have to use these colors. But it looks like I can't shoot up in this place. I can't shoot up. It's like I'm playing those... Um... I was... <laughs> I don't know, I was, I was gonna say, like, Goldeneye, but no, that doesn't really work. Maybe, like, could you shoot up in Doom? I don't think you could. Because I think you were, like, stuck, like, on the one level, and you have to just, like, to be able to shoot at a different level, you have to, like, go off of a jump. Because you can't jump. But, at least I'm pretty sure you can't jump, I don't remember. Eh, uh, whatever. Let's just, let's just do this thing. And time for the final battle. The final countdown. It's a good thing I'm a construction worker. Oh, okay, so that's what I have to shoot then. But still, it's a good thing I'm a construction worker going before I went in here. Oh. I went past my disguises a few times there, and I wasn't just paying attention enough, I guess. Yes, give me all those studs. And now I'm gonna shoot this thing with my color gun. Oh, what is that? What the heck is that? It's like some sort of puzzle. Um, oh, so, oh, maybe I'm going to be driving that mech around. Oh, yes, please be that. Okay, so, hmm. There's two different designs here that I can see. It looks like I'm supposed to be changing this thing to make it look like that, though. Only the mega fig. Uh, oh, maybe I can just jump into it now, and then that's... The mech is made for just moving things around. Okay, that makes sense, maybe. Oh. I wanted to see if this ha thing had any attacks, but... It doesn't really look like it. It can jump! Oh, that symbol's Blackwell, okay. Blackwell Industries Incorporated. Okay, how to get ready. Um... Did I just... I think I might have exited out of that. Um, what am I supposed to do? Um, close that around, and same with that, move it. Because I think that it's supposed to, like, spin around in circles or something like that. And then... This, is that a thing? Um, hmm. It appears as though it's actually, it's already going right now anyway, so, uh, What if I just pull that off? I am confused. Oh, what if we go into a never-ending loop of win? <laughs> oh, boy. Let's, uh, let's just make this go into a giant circle, like that, and then we go and... Move that around. I think I'm, I'm making some progress here. 
So that's that's very uh, it's very pretty. Although, oh, maybe, maybe, just maybe, we go like this, and uh, we don't do that. No. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's let's look at this thing again. The design pattern. Okay, it goes up, and then it turns downward. Okay. Let's see if I can remember that. This turns down. And then this goes around. Lego City How about that? Selected as destination. Yay! Disengaging shield. Launching in five, four, what? three. I hope you're strapped in safely. One. Did I just like send a nuclear missile to like shoot Lego City or what? So it sounds like it's gonna happen. No, come on! My pack lunch was in there. Oh no. You! What have you done? Take a guess, Blackwell. We're going home. No! I will not return to that society of blinkered fools. I tried building something truly wonderful for them. A self-contained world which they'd never have to leave. An utopian habitat that catered to their every whim and desire. It was a monument to my genius. You were a great man once, Blackwell, but you've gone crazy. Crazy? Your monument was nothing more than an apartment block with a shopping mall. Turn us around. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we're locked in. Bring her over here. Chase. Oh no, not Natalia. That's pretty low of you, Blackwell, threatening a lady. Oh no, no, no. I would never hurt a lady. I just want her to watch you get squashed. Hey there, McCain. Oh. Thanks so much for getting me this from the museum. <laughs> wow. Wow. That has literally come back to bite me. <laughs> Whoa, that was close. Be careful. We'll need those energy tanks to run my moon base. No, you do, do ya? Okay, so. My my mech versus uh, his Rex Fury T Rex thing. Uh, how how do we do? We just have to like sit here and wait for uh, the T Rex to attack or what? I I just don't even know. Oh wait, I can press A on these things. Okay. Should I just attack him or what? Throw. No, that didn't seem to do anything. Oh well, I'll, I'll attack the energy tanks then. Cause that T-Rex uh, doesn't seem to be uh, caring. Oh, okay, so you can actually aim these things like properly. So what I'm gonna do here is go like this. Go! Okay, my aim may be not working so well, uh, but I can, I can still do this. Ugh. Okay, maybe, maybe we're not supposed to do that, and instead, we're just supposed to attack Rex Fury. In which case, I will try to do that. I will try, but probably fail. Uh, come on. There you go. Die. Hey, 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 hey. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to press A. Oh, I'm supposed to tap it again. At least I, I'm really... It's a good thing I have this giant loader thing. So this is... It's very uh, handy. Oh, wow. We're turning into Super Mario 64. Ah, so long, Bowser. That. You're ruining everything. You can do it, Chase. This Be is totally quiet. Super Mario 64, Don't though. Don't sit there like a lemon, Rex. Get him. Whoa. I can't jump. Oh, wait. No, I can jump with this thing. What am I thinking? Ah. Uh, I don't care if I live or I don't care if I live or die, I'm gonna go kill you today. Uh, no, no, press A. Smash the A button. Even before it tells me to. Yes. This is pretty awesome though. Basically just pretending that this uh this T-Rex is Bowser. Yo, that stings! You are useless, Rex. This way, Kowalski. Where you going, Blackwell? Oh, no. They don't. 
But see, this is why, like, he should have just, like, attacked me in person. Because if he had this T-Rex thing... Like, hey... Well, I guess he didn't think that I was going to have a loader, though. Because if I didn't have this thing, he would instantly beat me, probably, so... But then again, if, he, if it was just one-on-one, -on -one, nobody actually, you know, caring... My Kung Fu might not be able to kill him. And chase your fried. <laughs> um. It was an almost fried. Chase, he's. Huh? Command module separation complete. Oh, what? Blackwell, that filthy worm. Self destructive in now. Now? <laughs> That's pretty impressive. I don't know why, like, more places don't have that kind of feature. Self-destruct in now. Although I imagine hitting the ground will. Wait, so... Oh, so we're actually, like, literally flying back to, uh, Lego City right now, which would... Oh, that's very dangerous. Oh, well. Attack everybody and arrest. Or maybe not. What am I supposed to be doing here? Not dying? That's, that might be an idea. Um, hey, come over here and jump in the hole, maybe. See a box. One out of three. So it looks like I just have a timed amount of things. I, I'm i timed and I have to try... Well, maybe I can, I can save the world! Oh, wrong thing. With my fire extinguishing devices. No, it seems like that does not really do anything over there. Um... No! We must hurry up! There must be something else to do around here. It's like, oh man! It's like one other box, probably. Oh, there it is! I gotta stop jumping into the nothingness. Jumping into the nothingness is something I'd, I probably should not be doing. No. Let's see, what's this? Oh, it looks like that's the pieces of the T-Rex that was left. Oh, yes! Rex is... Tempest? I'll take that, whatever it is. Exactly. Because I'll I'll take all the vehicles. And then I can buy them all and just mess around. Although I think I already unlocked the T-Rex for like free roam, haven't I? Okay, so another piece just ripped off. At least that's a, a piece that doesn't look like I need. Um Oh no. You're okay. Yeah, but you're about to be not okay. Are you mad? We're plummeting to our doom. Ladies before gentlemen, get him, boys. Oh, well, I guess that it does matter if I do die because I'm losing a lot of my, like, true city hero thing. Attention, but regrettably, you pair are still in one piece. Although, I'm happy to report that I don't think that will be the case for long. Well, we should be fine. We, d we can just deus ex machina this type of thing up. Everyone important is safe in the command module with me. Oh, along with long billions of studs worth of gold. So really, Ooh. this is just a setback. A minor inconvenience. Oh, there's so many. Am I supposed to? Oh, I think I have an idea. Because Rex Fury is just sitting there. Back on the and then I throw somebody I at him. Yeah! I will I'm a genius! And my oh no! Else. Rex Fury is like invincible. Hey, oh well, don't worry, I'll do it. Oh no! Will destroy Lego City. Not if I can and help I'll it. Make oh no. Natalia watch as I do so. <laughs> and I'll make Natalia watch just because I can. Chase McGain. I heard Chase McGain. You have a lot to gain. Oh, oh wait. Uh, sir. What is it? But he was Can't you see I'm Oh, come on. The parachutes won't open and we can't get to the emergency release lever. What? what? Right there. Right there. I'll look for something to help in this cupboard. But that's the escape pod. 
Yes, it is! <laughs> Can you tell me, how do I get the doors to flare? Stop it! Uh, it's very hard to, to pay attention to what he's saying there when I'm trying to survive and kill Rex Fury, even though, like, it seems like throwing more guys at him doesn't doesn't seem to be doing anything. Even when I do that, he just like picks me up and throws me. I just don't know. Maybe if I maybe I'm supposed to like, oh, <laughs> he just attacked me on his own. I probably could have countered. Or if I just press A, yes, just regularly attacking him doesn't work. His regular A's do nothing. But. This kind of A is Fonzie time to win. <laughs> I don't know. Knock it off. Ooh. So then I guess when he comes down here, I just need to go like that and then go, whoa. Wrestle you down to the ground. Hey, hey arrest. It. Nice. Actually arrested uh, Rex Fury. Oh, maybe not. You've ruined everything, McCain! But this isn't the last you've seen of Mir! I will have my revenge! Huh? What? Phew. Uh, wh wh where, how, where'd that cow come from? Oh no! It's time to skydive! We're gonna have pretend that we're Master Chief and fall down through the atmosphere, possibly, which is... I would think probably would kill. Natalia, it should kill right? Chase Where on Rhea entry, but maybe he's like what? Master Chief. Oh. Natalia. Yeah. Is that a long distance number? Because we're in space. That's maybe the unfortunate thing. Oh, what is that thing? It looks. It looked like there was some tentacle monster coming out of the ship or something like that. But this also makes me sort of think of like Star Wars Episode 3. That's another form of like ship re-entry and they just barely like survive. Because they have the powers of the force and then they just go, hey look at me. I can, I can fly properly. Also like what is, was I supposed to do something differently there? I'm just, I like that I can just- oh, you can go faster, too, okay. I was wondering what, like, that button did, but apparently that's uh, something that can be done. So I might as well speed this up. I will catch up! Don't worry! This is really epic music right now, though. Like, man. If, if I was falling through space about to die, this would be the best music to be playing. I don't know. I might actually get like the full True City Hero thing right now. You can do it, Chase! I believe in you! Especially since like I think I died when I was inside that ship. Oh no! It's probably the easiest free fall thing that I've done though so far. Which is pretty nice. Ooh! Except for right here. <laughs> here comes the difficult free fall portion. And then we have to go through the depths of the depths of the Death Star. And then we have to make sure it blows up. And then, although uh, Forrest Blackwell already flew away like uh, Darth Vader does. Oh yes, Lego City Hero. I was hoping that was gonna happen. Rex Fury. So I guess that that was missable. That would suck so bad if I actually missed it. So, I mean, I kind of need that disguise. For freedom and for free plays! I think that they're called free plays. Also, like, yeah, we're kind of going right. We've already gone through the atmosphere like multiple times, I think. Multiple kilometers, and Chase is somehow alive. Oh, wait, only seven seconds left? I didn't know that there was time. Oh, no. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I just barely made it. That was... That was close. 
Maybe we weren't through the atmosphere yet, if I actually had, like, a time limit. I don't know. All I know is that LEGO people, they're, they're more resilient. They, they don't, they just, they just melt a little bit. It's no good, Dad. We can't reach the parachute release. Excuse me. Did anyone order a hero? And a pizza. Chase, pull that lever. This lever? Okay. What is it? The brakes. Uh-oh. Professor Kowalski's on his way. He oh, I thought he had like a, a baguette that Frank now. was holding. And what about the tons of falling debris from the rocket? Don't worry, Chief. I've got you covered. The debris splashed down at sea, Marion. <laughs> That's awesome. Mind if I park here? Oh, oh, there they are! Congratulations. You've done it again, Chase. Almost. Blackwell got away in an escape pod, and Rex, well, he got away too, I uh... Rex? <laughs> Rex isn't a problem. Oh? He crashed headfirst through someone's roof ten minutes ago. Get this off of uh, me! What is that on his head? <laughs> hey, Rex, you don't look very flushed with success. Oh, so it is a toilet. I, uh... uh... Ah, I thought you should get the arrest this time. You know what? You can have it, Chief. Some things are more important than work. Oh. <laughs> yeah. You're talking about video games, right? <laughs> yeah. Totally. Oh, it's that one guy that was on the bicycle all this time. He almost came to kill us all. And then he was gonna multiply and turn into the rest of, like, the Agent Smiths, or whatever. Yeah. I almost 100%ed that mission, though. That was pretty close. Yay! Like, what is that, like, Rex's Tempest thing? I, I don't know. I want to see what it is, though! That's, that's my mission for right now. Yay, 100% LEGO City Hero! Although, like, yeah, I definitely didn't complete everything in that mission, though, just because of, like, I had one more, like, piece of the police badge to complete it. Oh, well, continue story! Or continue story as in it's the credits. Wow. And they have to have, uh, Walking on Sunshine for the credits. Yet again. This song still really works very well for this game, though. It's... I'd say, like, it fits the mood of just being, like, happy, bright, and just like, yeah! Such a great song, and so on. But yeah, that basically would have been, like, the perfect ending right there is what they shown. So I don't think that they would have had to have, like, another cutscene right after that. That's a very satisfying ending, though, is that, like, Rex... Fury got uh, his head stuck in a toilet. Forrest Blackwell is flying off into space like Darth Vader and is going to be probably picked up by his Imperial fleet yet again. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Chase is all happy. And Natalia seems to not hate him anymore. Although, I. Let's see how long that lasts for if they have a sequel of this game. Well, other than because there was the prequel, of course, that was on the 3DS. I'm gonna have to play that at some point, of course. Unfortunately enough, I can't record that because I don't have the ability to record on a 3DS. But you know, you know how it is. I'll at least I'll at least play that game, and then I'm gonna enjoy it and uh, see what the story was like for how Natalia got so upset when she was apparently like an, a, a reporter or something like that, and then. Uh, Marion Dunby had, like, he stole the, the first arrest of Rex Fury. He was just like, ah, I got promoted. What is this song? Is this, is this, like, even part of the soundtrack, like, anywhere else in the game? Um, all right. I, I don't remember hearing the song before. But, anyway, I 
I had a lot of fun with uh, Lego City Undercover. It's a really good game. It was it was worth the price. I think it well, yeah. I was saying like yeah, it was definitely worth the price. I don't really remember what the price was that I paid for it. I think I, I paid. I think only like it was like a fifty dollar game. So I think it's cheaper than most, surprisingly enough. Which is uh, it's always good. Oh look, there's the cast. Although it doesn't actually say who's who. Maybe I already missed that because I'm not paying attention to the credits right now. But they have a lot of voice actors for that because this is like the. Actually, no, this isn't the first LEGO game that actually has voice acting, but it's it's kind of close, I still think. And it seems it was totally worth it that they did actually have voice acting in this game, because the voice acting was superb. Very good. Especially with uh, all the Chase McCain stuff. Chase McCain, he is a boss who kills aliens and doesn't afraid of anything. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, man. But that is pretty much the end of this series, I would think. I still... Uh, after this little thing, I'm going to cut and see like what those vehicles are and stuff that I unlocked. I don't know how much more of this game I will be showing, though. Because, still, I I do, I do will want to go back and like complete all the missions pretty much like 100% at some point. But, I mean, it's pretty much just me going through the exact same thing as before in a way, but just having a, a little extra, like, a few extra frills here and there that are fancy, so I don't know if it's exactly worth it. I mean, like, it might be worth it to show, like, me just exploring the city free roam style, because that's, there's so much to explore in LEGO City. So that could be, that could always be, like, an additional, like, hey, LEGO City Exploration Part 1, the all-new beginning. <laughs> that, that could totally be, like, a... A title right there. Maybe I should like write that down for later. But yeah, that is pretty much it for now. I'll be sitting through the rest of the credits. There might be another cutscene. I don't know. But I will show you uh, what that Rex Fury device is, uh, and I'll buy it and uh, go from there. Oh, here we go. This is more like the music of uh, Lego City Undercover, all right. Twenty-six point three percent complete, just from beating the story. Not very much. Oh, so there is a cutscene thing afterwards, I think. Well, ish. What is this? Frank is chasing down... What? <laughs> just uh, whistling at him. Yeah, so I guess they, that's just their version of... Uh, Showing their logo, I guess. But I guess, I think that they did something like that for, uh, like, all their LEGO games in general. So I think they did something like that for uh, when they did Star Wars LEGO. That, like, at the very end, they showed, like, a little building of their uh, logo with Star Wars characters. Something like that. I don't remember, though. I don't remember. But I'd just like to say as well that this, like, LEGO City Undercover definitely is, I'd say, my favorite LEGO game of all time, though. This, this LEGO game's so good. The best and the longest, actually. Because all the other uh, LEGO games have actually been really, really short. This one, this one was a decent amount of time. It was, it was not like 10 hours or less of a game. I've unlocked Brick Multiplier. That's pretty good. I need that because, I mean, then I'm able to uh, build all those super builds a lot faster. And we all know how super builds are important. I I also need to do this for old time's sake. Uh, hey guys, you, you mind just eating some donuts for me? You, you want to give me a donut out of your pocket? It might be a little bit uh, lint filled or something like that, though. But I'm not I'm not picky. I I just want a donut, please. <laughs> Come on, Hermione, you you can summon it with magic, so you can. You don't even need to pull it out of your pocket, but whatever. Uh, let's just go in to buy things. Find... Okay, so I have to find a keycard, but... <laughs> lol, I don't even need a keycard. I can just fly up here. Oh, wow! Like, there's actually, like, uh... What do you call those things that you just, like, stand on top of and, like, they're, they're two-wheeled and they just, like, move around and they're just, like... Oh... Uh, I, that's that's my best description of it. You, you figure, oh, it's a Segway. That's what you call them. 
If you could have figured that out what a uh, segue was before I actually said it, then uh, you're smart. <laughs> I don't know, but you like I just unlocked a segue. Okay, here we go. Look at this thing. I really hope that this has NOS on it. <laughs> the ultimate segue ever. Now with NOS. Oh, maybe not. It appears as though there is no NOS at all. And it's not very fast either. <laughs> Why is this even a thing? Why is this a thing that they have in the game? It has terrible, like, handling as well because it's a segue. But. Wow. It's actually it's pretty impressive that they actually put this into the game, though. I uh, I'm not gonna be able to get out of here. <laughs> like awesome powers myself. Okay, let's let's check the other vehicles then. And just because I can, <laughs> here's a steamroller. Oh, see, this thing's much faster. It seems like everybody just runs away from me now. Fear the roller. <laughs> you will all die. Oh, including me, because I, I think I'm, I, I'm almost stuck. Yeah, I, I think I'm stuck. Yeah. <laughs> At least I can have the beeping for like backing up. And then some guy's just like gonna walk out of his house, and be like, hmm, why is there a roller in my driveway? I can't get out of my garage. Oh well. Oh. This guy seems a bit upset. Well, sir, you it would like would you like some water sprayed on your face? Start soon, it's very buddy. refreshing on this hot day. <laughs> oh, it does it actually knocks people down. And this doesn't actually look exactly like water because it like leaves like light yeah, it's like whitish streaks on the ground. So it might be like the carbon dioxide thing of a bobber or something like that. I don't know. Okay, there we go. Speaking of Rex Fury, um, yeah, Rex is brute. I colored it to be brighter red than the red it usually is. Oh, this thing actually has NOS on it. Yeah, see, this is more what I'm talking about. Oh, it's not very good for handling, though. I mean, like, it turns, when you turn a corner with NOS, you, like, fly around the corner. Just look at that. This is crazy. Yeah, look where you're going. I'm just gonna smash Whoa. you into things. Go, cement mixer. <laughs> oh, I, I, was, I always just have to check if that has NOS on it. I have to check that on every single vehicle just in case. See, you, you never know. You never know. You might have NOS on uh, one of these uh, trucks. Seems to be not too bad, though. A lot of like the other vehicles that I have left are pretty much just ridiculous like this and aren't exactly that necessary to show off because they're just like, here's here's a bus, it's just a bus, you know what a bus looks like? It's a bus, yeah. Well, that is a busted ATM, I had to check because I was gonna, <laughs> gonna bust it up, but I'm gonna go uh, buy Rex Fury. I think that that is pretty much it though, like, I, I did quite a bit in LEGO City in this series, I find. I mean, I'm only like 26% done the game, but... It was it was very good. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to do before I quit though, and hit people that are apparently invincible and rock hard. I guess they just have rock hard abs because they've been working out non-stop. Yeah. But I I need to finish this park because this I have unfinished business with this place. Actually, I think I already finished it though. <laughs> now I think about it. Yeah, I think I already finished the park. <laughs> Lol. So, the, the park is already finished, so, uh, yeah. I, I will need to do some shopping, yeah, like this guy was saying, in the way of buying Rex Fury and uh, going from there. And possibly, I, I think that is probably a good idea, that I will, that's an idea of something I'll do in the future. I'll just go and do my exploration of the city with all of my disguises and uh, see what I can see. And make that into, like, a, a series of sorts. Which uh, could be pretty awesome, because exploring the city of LEGO City is huge and uh, entertaining to me. For the most part, so uh, yes. That is it for now of the amazing uh, storyline of LEGO City Undercover, and I will see you uh, next time, possibly for that, and uh, so on and so forth.
Goodbye for now. Jetpack into the future. Oh, nope. There we go. Jetpack into the future. Yay. 